The Tasmanian Premier will deliver her first budget this afternoon and it's being described as a make-or-break set of figures for Lara Giddings. The state's finances are in disarray, stemming from ever-increasing government spending and a drop in GST revenue. The Premier has already talked tough on major public sector reform, flagging plans to cut the equivalent of 2,300 public sector jobs from the state's wages bill. Tom Lynch is the General Secretary of the Community and Public Sector Union in Tasmania. Look, I'm extremely worried for my members, but, but more importantly, I'm worried for the whole Tasmanian community. I understand the cuts that will be announced today are going to have a major impact on public services. So Tasmanians across the board who are already feeling the, pinch, the pressure from cost of living and uh, uh, an economy that's been running fairly slowly for a long period of time are now going to be denied basic services. And that's really the, uh, you know, uh, going to really hurt Tasmanian families. But Tasmania has a, a high public service spend and a high number of public sectors to employees, so it's inevitable that the acts will fall in that area. Cuts do have to be made. Uh, what level of cutbacks are you prepared to suffer? Well, look, uh, at, at the end of the day, all states have to live within their means, and we, and, and we need to do that in Tasmania. But it's the way this government has wasted and mismanaged money over the last five to ten years, and now suddenly they're going to make massive cuts across the public sector. What we really needed was to look at what services were essential to the community, what services did the community really value, and then work out the public sector workforce that was needed to provide them, rather than announce cuts up front. You know, the Premier announced in, in February up to 2,300 full-time jobs would go. That's the wrong way to go and it shows she doesn't have a focus on services to the community. You're planning a protest outside state parliament this afternoon as the budget is being handed down. How big an event do you anticipate that will be? Look, I think there'll be many hundreds of people turn out today uh, to tell the Premier that they believe she's on the wrong path, that the decisions she's taking are not in the best interests of all Tasmanians. They are a direct breach of promises that she made just 12 months ago in the state election, uh, that she's chosen the wrong course and she needs to, to, uh, to change direction now. This budget is not in the interest of Tasmanians. It is the, it is the wrong thing for an economy that is really slowly pulling out of, uh, out of the, the recent downturn. Tom Lynch, thank you. Thank you very much.